Hey guys, we are getting ready to undertake a project in our RV. Um, we are in the process of doing some renovations and um, and in renovating we are our next project is to remove our existing sleeper sofa. Let's see if we can get it turned around here. Our existing sleeper sofa right there. We are going to remove that and we bought a replacement. Yeah. So we're going to be replacing the sleeper sofa in our RV. Hopefully something that our kids will actually like sleeping on. <laughs> it looks nice. And it looks nice, <laughs> right? So um, the first step is to get the old one out of here. So that's what we're getting ready to do. Here we go. Let's figure this out. like that it was gone you was gone right now we're planning to leave the carpet in place just so there's something to cover the floor because we're not prepared to try to match the floor and the rest of the RV so we're just gonna leave the carpet there for now somebody uh, want to come do the floor for us that'd be great <laughs> <laughs> any volunteers <laughs> and you could see like last would last time we worked on this we took the all of our um, balances out so yeah. We removed all of those, which opens things up pretty well. It's real wide open now with no couch in it. I'm almost like, well, maybe I don't. I'm looking at curtains now. I don't know what to do. If should I put curtains up there or not? Because then I'd have to get, I have to get a rod to go here, and there's not enough room. Well, you might be able to put a little hook there though, and do the rod that sets into the yeah. into the little yeah. The little yeah, couch. those things. Yeah, but. It's, Still, it's I don't know. It'd be like really. It would be nice to cover no, up those. It'd be, I, I was only thinking to have curtains here just because of this. It would kind of right. help cover that Disguise up so we're not little. going bling 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 right. bling 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 Those are the things that keep the mini blinds in place. <laughs> um, there's one that was broken. That one's broken. So I've got to fix that one. We have one in the back that's broken. Oh, yeah. So what Hard happens is these strings break over time and when they break they have repair kit for them so and then your blinds become like this <clears throat> so right. then they become like this and, but they're floppy and they don't <laughs> <laughs> now you gotta fold that back up so <laughs> all right. here's, your, here's your repair kit and they give you that's a hundred feet of cord for the blinds oh, and, and also new spools for the walls to keep the pressure and some other little bits and pieces that if you need to replace them, there you go. And then you just weave them right through. So we'll do, maybe we'll do a video when I do them. Yeah. There you it's go. The... Oh, no, it's just... <clears throat> Step one, complete. Well, not quite complete because we still got to throw away the old stuff. Well, yeah. It's not going back in anywhere because we broke it. <laughs> well, we permanently removed it. Let's put it that way. Yeah, it's not going back <laughs> it ain't in going back in. <laughs> oh, man.
have finished and here is the reveal. La, 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 la. Oh my gosh, I really want to paint now. <laughs> there we go. And that's a little sign that I bought that kind of goes with the little green that we still have in here and the, and the smoky gray and I don't know what to call all of that, but that's kind of a theme we'll try to keep since we kept all the blinds from the windows and they have the green tint to them. So yeah, that was a pain in the butt. Well, but <laughs> it wasn't as, it wasn't as bad as what a lot of people have. A lot of people have a lot of trouble with the couch replacement and this fit, you know, it wasn't easy, but it wasn't too bad either. Just, we had no. a, couple, a couple little things that were a challenge for sure. Yeah, we lost a drill bit. Well, lost a drill bit there. <sighs> if it ain't one thing, it's another. Yep. Did I you get it back? It. Did you ever get oh, it back? Yeah, That's it. right, you got it back. So, but yeah, but it got stuck in there. And and um, and if your name is Alan, curse you, Alan Rich. <laughs> I'm gonna hate you. No, no. More, no more screws from you. <laughs> You're screwed, Alan. The Allen wrench thing, we had to put this entire couch together with Allen screws. Alan screws. Yes. And the only thing we got to use the drill for was to um, secure it to the floor. So, um, did we get pictures of that or video? We, I don't think we did that. Well, we have it. It's in the time lapse. It oh, that's by, right. It goes by very quick, though. Yeah. So, so link. yeah. So, we didn't have anything because this is up off the floor um, a little bit, about what maybe. I don't know, two, three inches off the floor, maybe? At least an inch and three eighths. Oh, that's right. Because it put, so we have four little <laughs> three tiny. Quarters, that's three quarters, inch and three quarters. Okay. Two yes. Two by four. Right, two by four. So we have like four little legs on each corner, you know, they're like that. And so there was a space between the couch and the floor and we needed, we wanted to bolt it, you know, to the floor of the RV. So, um, so JT got some pieces of two by four and he put them, they fit just snugly right under uh, the couch there and so he bolted the two by fours to the floor of the RV and then we attached the couch to the two by fours right so yay work so now we treat. yeah we ain't going nowhere and it pulls out super cool <laughs> <laughs> do you want to see okay let's see if I can do this <laughs> I get nervous because it's really cool all right so we pull the handle here just and tip it up just a little bit. A little more. A little more. Okay, oh, oh, and look. Whoa! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> I think this is so cool. And look. I don't want to get my shoes on the on the bed. So like two two full size people on here. Yeah, we both got on there and there was room still. Yeah, and JT's feet were hanging off the thing, but that's okay. You know, you get your nice little pillows up here and then I don't want to get my shoes on here, but then if, if, so let's say we want to maybe watch TV, you know, you can put your nice little reclining pillows back here and then we can tip the TV a little bit and chill out and relax and watch TV this way if you want to. All right. Now, and then this is the coolest thing too. So you have to pull this up until it locks, right? Or yeah. until you hear it lock. There it goes. And then push down. Down. <laughs> I love this couch <laughs> and it's nice and soft. It's, you know, it looks like it might be leather, but it's leather, so, fake leather. Yeah. I don't know. It's, it's, you can wash it off. So yeah, it's nice and it, and it smells new. <sighs> yep. So goodbye old pull out sofa that had ick underneath it yeah we didn't show we didn't show any video no no b-roll of us tossing it in the junkyard no but i think we have some stuff of landfill. us throwing out the door <laughs> yes we do have video of that so here's our new couch yay yay good job five round of applause for five rookies two rookies next <laughs>